lot of focus, rightly so, on what Tiger Woods did here in 2008. But in this military town, San Diego, it's worth considering what might well be the most heroic performance in U.S. Open history on this diamond anniversary. In the mid-1940s, Lloyd Mangrum was offered a club job in Maryland which would have kept him out of combat in World War II. He turned it down, instead going to Europe to fight against tyranny. He was wounded at Normandy in the Battle of the Bulge, awarded two Purple Hearts. Mangrum once said that given what he had been through, it would be hard to think of a three-foot putt as one of the really bad troubles in life. Six months after he returned from the war, Mangrum made a seven-footer in a rainstorm to win the 1946 U.S. Open. Before the Normandy landing, Mangrum ripped the $1 bill in half and gave the other half to his best buddy, Robert Green. They agreed they would put it back together after the war. Green didn't make it back. Mangrum carried that torn dollar bill with him the rest of his life. This week, every competitor must know how fortunate they would be to have a seven-footer in the San Diego sunshine to win the U.S. Open.